Well, it's got a lot to do with uh, my grandfather and my dad. Um, they started back in the 60s, and I guess uh, just kind of went from there. Started with a few cows and stuff, and uh, then we got more into the feedlot in side of things, and uh, just kind of grown from there. Um, we sold our cows. We were up to 100 and some cows at one time, but uh, just kind of converted over to beef cows and uh, strictly uh, feedlot on the buffalo side now. Yeah, I love it. Uh, brought up ever since I was little and worked for him all throughout high school and ever yeah. since. And uh, love being out here and working with the yeah. buffalo and farming. Well, a sound guard cab uh, on an older tractor like this, uh, very dependable tractor as far as that goes. Uh, and if you went to trade it, you're not going to get much. So therefore, it's worth more to me here than it is somebody else. A common guy with a little common sense can still work on it. We don't need a computer to work on. Tractor mats always provided uh, mats for the new, newer style of tractors and everything that coming out, the new tractors. And uh, you know, it's great that they. Uh, launch a new product for the older tractors because these are still great tractors and people still do use them and uh, you know it's really nice to have a, a nice mat in there. <laughs>